All right, in training for uh, web accessibility and Joomla editing, I will often mention anchor links, but I don't actually teach you how to do anchor links. So this video is going to show you how to do anchor links. I am currently logged into the front end of Benjamin Banneker Elementary School. So this can all be done through the front end. So website uh, editors and webmasters, you guys should both have access to um, front end editing. Let's jump in and do this. Uh, an example already exists on the school page of Anchor Links. It is the nurses page. The nurses page has a lot of information. Um, because it has so much information, we made this table of contents. The table of contents is just a bunch of anchor links. So if I click asthma forms, I jump down to asthma forms. Pretty cool. Uh, in fact, if I were to copy the address for asthma forms and go to it, I would go to the page and then immediately jump down to that location. That is how an anchor link works. Okay. So, um, if we look up here at the top of my screen, you will see that there is the URL for the page, um, bbes slash nurse, and then there is a hashtag or a pound sign or a number sign, I mean, whatever you want to call it, uh, and then asthma, okay? So this hashtag asthma is our anchor link. That is the secret password, the secret code word that activates the anchor link. All right, so I'm going to click this little gear with the carrots. I'm going to go to edit, and I'm going to go into this page and show you how the anchor link is made. Uh, let's zoom in a little bit here. Oh, there we go. We're really zoomed in. Uh, there is an anchor symbol here next to immunization requirements indicating that we have inserted an anchor. Uh, here in the tools, you can see the anchor tool. If I mouse over, it says create anchor. So wherever, here we go, uh, entering kindergarten through fifth grade. So wherever the cursor is, that is where the anchor link is going to be inserted. So if right here where it says students entering kindergarten through fifth grade, I have my cursor, the little flashing line here, and that's where the anchor link is going to be put in. So I'm going to go up here and I'm going to click create anchor. Now I make a secret password. It is case sensitive. So if it's capital here, it has to be capital when you use it again. So I'm going to put enter uh, and I'm going to hit insert. And now we have a secret anchor link that uh, is enter. And that will take us to this exact spot on the page. So if I go up here to this table of contents that's made out of anchor links, and I take a peek at it, all I'm doing to create this URL is just putting hashtag and then the secret password. So if I wanted to add the new section, I could just go here and put uh, entering school. Uh, looks like we're inheriting some stuff from the line above. There we go. I'm going to select all this. I'm going to do hyperlink and I'm going to put hashtag enter and insert. And now I will magically, uh, when I click here, uh, be taken down to that part of the page uh, right here. Students entering kindergarten. Pretty neat. Pretty neat. Uh, so that is how anchor links work. Now, how do I get it to work somewhere else, right? So I want to share out in an email, hey, check out the information for entering kindergarten through fifth grade, and I want them to follow the link and go directly to that part. So I'm going to cancel out of this because I don't want to actually save these changes. And what I would do is whatever the page URL is, um, I'm going to just use that same URL, and then I'm going to add uh, hashtag and whatever the anchor link is. Now I could share out this URL, and they will go to the page and to that specific spot on the page, thanks to the anchor link. And that's how anchor links work in Joomla.